Hello. How are you guys doing? It's been a minute since we've done one of these. It's been a minute. Um, and as a, a result, uh, I ask for your patience when I stumble through trying to get all these things to work. Um, I'm, I'm pretty hype. I'm pretty nervous. I hope that you guys enjoy what I've come up with. But uh, just for the sake of people who haven't been here before, I'm just going to say you don't have to have been here before in order to understand what's going on. I will have some characters from the previous series show up as a sort of like, you know, uh, thing for people who followed that. But you don't need to have watched the first season in order to understand what's going on in this season. I've made sure that that's the case just because uh, one of the, the biggest things that I feel like is an issue with these series is fixing that exact problem. So, um, yeah. Let me go ahead and open a couple more things. Uh, so it's good for new people. Each episode is more or less standalone uh, as a result of it being... Um, stupid alarm uh due to the way that i've set it up so uh if you miss an episode you're okay um but yeah anyway um let's get started yeah oh i guess i should say uh for people who haven't seen this before uh that's the kitty alarm i fed them early i fed them early because i didn't want any distractions so why don't I go ahead and just explain uh, how to interact with this if you haven't done this before. Um, if you look down below your chat, uh, there should be a little coffee pot. Uh, good job, dog. Thank you for the five months of support. It's very kind of you. Uh, play the video. I don't know if I actually have that captured. Give me a second to make a screen region for it. Sure. It's a very short video. Uh, media source, sure. Browse. Let me find it real quick. That is the best way to do this. All right, there we go. Very short. I should probably like Tumblr out or whatever the name of it is. All right, let's see if this works. Hopefully that the uh, the capture region isn't super borked. Welcome to the Town of Nowhere Season 2. You don't have to have watched Season 1 in order to understand what's going on in this. However, characters from the first season will be making guest appearances, so maybe when you have a chance, go watch it. This season is going to be taking place with multiple different main characters. Each episode is a different main character, which means that you don't have to have watched the previous episodes in order to understand everything going on. In order to assist new players, I have a primary and secondary objective on screen at all times. The primary objective is what everyone is trying to achieve, and the secondary is what your specific character you're playing right now is trying to achieve. Every now and then, I'll ask you guys if you want to vote on what you want to do. When that happens, go check the bottom of the chat box. You should see an option that says Town of Nowhere option or TTON option click that put in what you want the character to do and then those options will be added to a poll everyone will get to vote on that in order to add options to the poll you'll need coffee points you get coffee points for free for just watching any of my streams whatever ends up getting the most votes by consensus will be the one that the character does that's it that's everything you need to know in order to participate it's basically D, &D but with chat controlling the character good luck don't die all right that's legitimately all you need to know in order to actually like play this. So uh, if someone new comes in and they're like, what's going on? How do I do this? Uh, someone in chat, please link that video because that will give all the information you need. Also, there's a resub from DeBuilder. Thank you for the 23 months of support. I'm going to be real bad about thanking people. So I'll try and thank everyone at the end uh, just to make sure that the flow stays good. Uh, I'll adjust the command. Thank you so much. Uh, Konso Como. Thank you for the uh, 11 months of support. Um, but anyway, let's get into it. Um, so right off the bat, I do want to explain uh, the guy in the corner is you. Uh, this will change every episode as a result. Um, hate that? Okay. Uh, I was thinking about putting the chat up there. Uh, and that way we can, uh, we can switch it over time. So that's the first main character. <laughs> sitting here has been torture you have been sitting here for what seems like hours though it's probably only like an hour you have been waiting and you didn't expect that the torture would be waiting you expected so many other things to be the issue to be the things that break you today but just the weight of the 
awful things that are to come, but the unfortunately necessary things that are to come. You hear our door open behind you. And you hear him walk in. Dress shoes on tile flooring as he walks up behind you. You keep your eyes shut in order to keep the pain out. To be able to just think clearly in this moment. To be able to do what you have to do in this moment. You hear him uh, as he walks past you. He says, sorry for the wait. Uh, let's begin the interrogation. Now, I guess we should start with the basics. What is your name? And then let me actually make it so that way you can choose that. It's not going to be Germa. We're not picking Germa. Nope. <laughs> you rejected. <laughs> All right, going to pause redemptions there. And then hopefully I did the thing right. Uh, shout out to Dustin Competent for making a uh, system that uh, helps. Uh, going to delete out the germas. True fact, I sent this to um, my sub discord and I was like, hey, what do you think of this guy? And they're like, oh, you know, he just looks like a guy. Kind of handsome, a little bit uh, violent. I'm like, does he look like Germa? That's what I'm thinking to myself. That's what I'm thinking to myself the whole time. Just being like, is this, is this him? All right. Vote. Oh, yeah, we're not going with big balls. <laughs> Once the uh, the the votes kind of settle down a bit, uh, we'll do the thing. But yeah, thank you to uh, Dustin Incompetent for making uh, this uh, vote thing go very fast. Uh, previously, I would have to individually... Um, Uh, enter all these names in, uh, but he made a thing that makes it a lot faster. And as long as I don't break it, it works really good. Um, it's a user error more so than anything else. It looks like it's a, a split tie between uh, two right now. Zachariah Ribbit, thank you for the 33 months of support. I have no, like, background audio for this bit, but that's on purpose. We're not doing the thing like we did in the first season as well. The, the sound thing, don't worry about it. We, we have a bit of a tie going. I'm waiting until, like, it's a little bit clear. I think we probably have gotten to the, the, uh, into the votes. So it looks like Mike Oxmall is your name. This is one of those things, right? Where it, it sounds like Mike Oxmall. Cool. Good. Uh, now, did that actually update? Yay! It works. Cool. Good, 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 good. You hear him sit down in a leather chair that must be somewhere in the room. Tell me. We're like a family here. We like to keep track of each other and really make sure that we take care of each other. And I want to take care of you. But I want to know that you want this. What, um, what do you know about us?
Where is my thing? I can't find the button. Like I said, I'm gonna be bad at this. Oh, there we go. All right, that's a lot of redemptions very fast. That's a good sign. People are excited to be here. I'm excited that you guys are here. Um, and then let's go ahead and, oh God, where are all the buttons? I'm losing track of all the buttons. There we go. New pull. Uh, create multiple choice. Link, copy, paste. There we go. You might have to give us a second to think. Okay, I'm sorry. It's just going so fast that, um, yeah, I'm sorry. I'll give you guys more time on the next ones. Vote. 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 I can't vote as a VPN user. I'm sorry. Uh, I tried to make it so that way everyone could vote, but there are uh, limitations on what I can actually le reasonably do. Uh, the the likes and dislikes will update as you guys uh, build out the characters. Similar to how No would, you know... Uh, probably like twerking or something if you watch the previous series uh, you would be able to like add those things as it goes so um, some characters will have more built out personalities but this one I'm letting you guys just go ham on so just enjoy uh, so to the question what do you know about us your answer is, it looks like, I love working at companies. Can I have some money? Well, yeah, that would, that would be why you were here. Um, honestly, I'm going to be real with you. We're very short staffed and, um, we're going to, we're going to need you to, to, to be able to work today. Is today okay? Like, are you able to work uh, starting today? Yes. I would bang them yes, no. Should I make it yes, no? Yes, but money up front. What are the benefits? Um, $15 an hour. Uh, you get lunch breaks sometimes uh, when we're not super busy. Uh, we, we do have uh, some some rules here. I, ho I hope that's okay if we, we go over those uh, real quick before we get any further. I, I should probably just take you on a... Uh, you, do we have... No, we don't have dental. I'm sorry. Um... For context, is fifteen dollars minimum wage. Minimum wage in Texas, which is where this is taking place, is uh, seven twenty-five. So almost double minimum wage. So I'm going to be honest with you. The reason that we need you to actually uh, come in and work is because we've been having. Um, We've been having some issues. As you know, here at The Last Resort, we've been having uh, some issues since another older resort moved in uh, to town. And um, we're going to have to blow them out of the water. We're really going to have to make sure that we show our A game and make sure that we are... Um, 
the the best possible hotel resort beachside resort as you may know we are uh, located a scenic 500 mile walk from the uh corpus christi gulf of mexico uh bay perfect for people who just want to get away for the summer uh and um so yeah we're, we're, we're just gonna need you to uh work the front desk sometimes clean up rooms is that okay Uh, how about we do another thing? Okay, so I can... Okay, so don't close that. Close that. Alright. Complete all. Complete all. Alright. Redemptions are up. How many redemptions should I let through? Because I've been letting through, like, 12 to 13. I guess I should, for um, non-American viewers, I should explain that uh, 500 miles is roughly, like, 760 to 800 mile, uh, kilometers. Alright, I'm going to pause redemptions at uh, 20. That should be more than enough options. Uh, let's see. Are you using an updated version for V? I sent you an updated version for B the the for the the voting thing. Um, I can't really use that because it might break. Uh. The, the tool that we got. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and reject that so that way you get your... Oh! That's dust incompetent, chat! <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, Alright, let's see. Uh, create multiple choice. I was like, I don't want to do anything because dust incompetent worked real hard on this and if I screw something up then like, you know, but you know, no, that was you saying it, so okay, there you go. And then just pick all the ones that you feel like you like. Five hundred miles from uh, Corpus Christi is nearly out of the state. It's on the west coast. Or on the west side of Texas. It's like almost to New Mexico. Texas is very big. Uh, it's why most Texans don't leave the state. Texas is massive. How do y'all travel without breaking down in tears? Traveling from Austin to El Paso, which is on the west side, was an eight-hour drive that we did fairly often growing up. Um, there's, there's just nothing out there. It looks like we've got a winner. Uh, so normally what I do on these, I don't know as if I said it in the video, but I like to try and like combine ideas if, um, you know, it kind of like all works together. For example, uh, the top three are, sounds great. Can do. By the way, I like your horns, sir. They look very well polished. Compliment his horns. And yes, it's okay, but you secretly hate this. Um, I think all of those kind of work together. Um, so we'll combine them all and make that the thing that you do. Where you say, yeah, sounds great. Can do. By the way, I like your horns, sir. They look very well polished. But you're lying about the fact that you want to do this. <laughs> Which sounds correct. Great, great. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and get you set up at the front desk. Why don't we go ahead and uh, take a tour? Um, mainly what we're going to try and do is going to make sure that we provide really solid customer service 
uh, for the next uh, few weeks. And then um, from there, we will uh, try and make sure that we run the best possible uh, party that we can. And then hopefully that puts the Sunset Resort out of business. And then we can be the oldest uh, resort in the area again. So solid service to customers is what we're gonna we're gonna be doing here. Um, so so anyway, let, let's let's go ahead and have a, a bit of a walk around here. Oh, did I put this? Okay, there we go. I'll have to move these up. He leads you out into the hall um, where there's multiple different uh, rooms and uh, obviously uh, a corridor that uh, leads to the front where you came in from. Um, let's go ahead and complete all of these. Wife and chat. Hi. Do we lose uh... the text? Doesn't. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, it does not fit. Uh, whoop. Is this going to work? Hmm, sort of. Okay, how about this? There we go. Uh, by the way, my name's Maxwell. I'll, um, I'm your boss. Uh, I, I run this place. Um, I, I try and help out around, you know, just do a little bit of everything, you know. Um, and uh, yeah, if you need me, just let me know. Um, so first off, uh, if you're going to be late for your shift, make sure you contact, uh, your, your manager in your department, uh, five minutes beforehand. Um, if, uh, you, you've got one 15 minute break and a 30 minute lunch break, uh, if you're on schedule for more than eight hours, uh, both are unpaid, but, and you're expected to clock out, um, if you see the intruder, uh, for your own sake, ignore it. Whatever you do, it only gets worse if you acknowledge him. I still cannot believe what they did to uh, Randy's face. Um, just I cannot look at him straight in the face. Uh, it's it's really messed up, and uh, just don't just don't look at him. He'll ignore you after a while. Just don't don't look at the intruder, no matter what. Um, uh, park exclusively in employee parking. Uh, all the other spots are for guests only. We want to make sure the front row seats are for our most valuable customers. Um, and then, uh, check the nose board before and after every shift. Um, anyway, um, any questions real quick before we, uh, start looking around and, uh, doing some, uh, some rooms, uh, looking at, uh, what we got here in, uh, our hotel here. Uh, let me go ahead and open that out. Okay. I'm going to let like 30 through this time. This is sort of a video game in that you get to play it if you interact uh, using uh, coffee bits like people are doing right now. And then your votes decide what happens. Okay. There's 31. Okay, that's a lot of things. Uh... Okay, cool. And then where's the chat thing? Create multiple choice. There we go. Copy and paste. Uh, I will uh, work out the thing that um, Dustin was talking about with the poll thing uh, next time um, for people who are using VPNs. I apologize for this. Um, I just don't want anything to go super duper wrong. What are we voting on? Uh, he just read off all the different uh, regulations and rules for the uh, the job.
I'm gonna I'm gonna be real with you. If come wins, I'm ignoring it. Uh, oh my god, who's raiding us? Oh, Fred, thank you for the raid, my dude. Uh, <laughs> so we're doing uh, my Twitch Plays D&D series called uh, The Town of Nowhere. This is season two. If you haven't seen it before, that's okay. This is with... I, I think everyone can uh, uh, confirm that this is a different uh, situation than the last one. Uh, so... Uh, don't don't worry about it too much. You just got a job at the Last Resort, which is a uh, resort located 500 miles, uh, a scenic 500 mile walk from uh, West Texas to the East Coast, uh, uh, the Gulf. And uh, your boss here is uh, trying to get uh, uh, you acquainted with everything that's going on. Um, and uh, yeah. Uh, so chat's currently voting on what they want to do. You decided to internalize the name Maxwell. You decide that maybe you could also go by Mac. Like, who knows? New town? New life? New situation? No reason not to just decide to change your name within, like, any moment. You're not the person you used to be. Five seconds ago, you were a different person, and now, you can be this guy, too. I'm gonna go ahead and add that. Whoops, that parentheses went the wrong way. Do we steal our map? Uh, no. Your boss's name is, uh... <laughs> is Maxwell uh not not Max uh, wait did you just decide to name yourself Maxwell because of that I guess you did <laughs> you then fall while you're you know making a mental note to change your name to his name because why not oh you decide that his name is Maxwell. That's an ADHD or dyslexia moment. You decide that his name is now Maxwell. You do not actually say this out loud, but you've decided that his name is Maxwell. Uh, you kind of drift off into your own thoughts for a minute while you do that, and then you bring up, yeah, actually, respectfully, sir, what happened to Randy's face? Um, well... The thing about the intruder is the more I talk about it, the more likely it is to uh, come after me as well. And I'm going to be honest with you. I, I just I need to not deal with that. If a uh, customer has an issue with it, they'll be able to deal with that and they'll be fine. Probably we won't have to deal. We have waivers. They'll, it'll be fine. But if you work here, you got to come here all the time and you don't want him messing with you all the time. Uh, it will make your life a living hell. I feel so bad for Randy. He still works here. I gave him a raise. Um, yeah, just, I, I can't, I can't tell you more, but you just, you'll know him when you see him, just ignore him, okay? Do your best to ignore him, okay? Is the intruder single? I don't, I don't know that, and I, I would expect so. Anyway, let me show you some of the rooms, um, so, uh, we've got, um, several, uh, suites. We use them for, uh, value customers. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, I, I believe this room is empty. Uh, oh, okay. No. Um, uh, sorry, sir. Um, okay. So did you know that, uh, Valerie Chekhov, uh, ended up, uh, saying, uh, in, uh, one of our rooms a little while back, the, uh, the, the famous, uh, chess player. Um, maybe it's pronounced Valori. I, I don't know. Uh, but, uh, after he left, um, I guess this is another thing you should know. Um, uh, this bell appeared in, in his room. Um, it doesn't move. It doesn't ring. It's just sort of here. Um, he pushes on it, and you can tell that it does not ring or move. Um, so we just don't we don't put anyone in this room. So if uh, if it, someone needs a, a room, don't put them in here. 
Um... And, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll be fine. Um, and then, um, if you come over here, uh, this, this is your desk. This is the front desk. Um, to your left there, you got the front door. We got a vending machine. You can buy snacks out of it if you want. Uh, and then we got the, uh, the hallway to your right. So that way you can go and get snacks if you're, uh, or, or go and, uh, lead customers to the rooms. Um, uh, yeah. So, um... Just, you know, if someone comes in, give them excellent service. Just because the Sundown Resort decided that they wanted to be the oldest resort in the area. And despite the fact that we were the oldest prior to them, we are going to be a better resort, okay? Okay, people? We're going to make this happen, okay? We're going to be a better resort than them. We're going to have all of the amenities. We're going to be the best resort. Okay, I'm going to leave you to it. Uh, just let me know if you have any issues, okay? Uh, do you guys want to ask him any questions before he leaves you? Yes, okay. Let me go ahead and, uh, make another pull. Again, I'm going to let 30 redemptions through. Jesus Christ, there's so many people. Okay, that's 35. <sighs> Create multiple choice. Click. Oh, dust. This thing works great, man. All right, there's a pull. I didn't clean up all any of the uh, the weird stuff, so if any of those win, uh, we're ignoring them. <laughs> uh... Complete all. There we go. I'm going to turn this down just a bit. That phone is so loud. What about this? Okay, that works. Okay, cool. Uh, so that should have been... Did I link it to you guys? I did, right? Yes, okay. Good, good, good. Uh, someone want to link the uh, video for the people who just got here so that way they know what's going on? Vault! Thank you, Mantis. Uh, we got a bit of a split. Is hand-holding a free action? Only with people who want to be handheld. What about toe-holding? That's never going to be a free action. That's weird. Uh, so it looks like it's a bit of a split, but they're not mutually exclusive things. Uh, so how, how about I, uh, just read off and respond to all those? Um, to clarify it, oh, can I meet any of my coworkers, sir? I want to get to know my new family. Well, everyone, um, you know, is, is doing their jobs. I'm sure, you know, as people are available, they'll come by and uh, greet you. But I mean, everyone's got work to do, just like you do. Uh, we have several residents that have booked appointments uh, that, that should be coming in. Uh, just, you know, like I said, smile. Um, look like you're, you want to be here. Because um, you do want to be here. Because we're a family. Um, 
To clarify, if the intruder attacks us, do we get more money? I'm, re I'm going to be very honest with you right now. You do, you do not want that. You do not want that. R Randy almost quit. He almost left town. Like, he can't. He can't. There's, there, there's no way that he's going to be able to make a, a, a life for himself here. He's not going to be able to have a, a family here. He's just, he's so messed up looking, dude. He's so messed up. It's not the same, Randy. Just as an aside. You don't know that, though. Um, what if it that customer is the intruder? How will we know? Um, you know... It's pretty obvious. I can't I can't describe it because if I did, then he'd know that I knew him. And so I can't tell you about him. But obviously, you'll know him when you see him, and you just you just need to ignore him, okay? Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and go. But uh if if you need anything, let me know, okay? Okay, I'm gonna go now. Good luck. You say bye to back Maxwell, Maxwell, which you're pronouncing M A K, M A C K space S W E L L Maxwell. This is incorrect, but you've decided it's his name now. You now are just sitting here, waiting for anything at all to happen. Turns out working at the front desk of a, a hotel kind of is boring. I'm going to open up Redemptions and allow you to do something. Oh my god. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right, I need to close it. That was 40. <laughs> Okay. Um, new poll. God, this would be actually impossible without um, Dustin's thing. You guys are pushing it to the limit. All right. There's the poll. Again, I, I cannot clean out all of these fast enough. Uh, look through all the options. Thank you, Dustin. You are a absolute champion. Uh, let's see. And then complete all. Results. Uh, answer the phone to stop the forsaken ringing. Looks like whoever was calling hung up. Sorry about that. That's that's more me just admitting that I, I didn't realize that the office sound effect was annoying as hell. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't realize that it was going to be like that. That is not excellent service. Ignoring the phone is a free action. <laughs> he decided to get a snack from the vending machine. And then consider ordering an emotional support plushie online in order to get it same day. You'll need to figure out which one uh, you, you want to get. Um, there's a lot of options, but which one speaks to you? The internet has so many options. 
Um, you also consider how Chekhov's bell will come back and ruin your life. You don't know anything about um, Valery Chekhov, the chess player, but he definitely exists and is a cool guy, I guess. Let's start with the first of those things. So there's two different things that uh, are on the list here. Um, get a snack or, uh, and then the other one is order a support plushie. Um, you don't have access to a computer that will have any sort of access to the internet. Whatever computer there is at this desk appears to be running like DOS for some reason. Um, so you'll have to wait. Uh, but you can at least consider which one you'll order as soon as you get off your shift. Uh, do we not have a phone? Uh, you do, but this thing is like a, a metal box. Like, there's absolutely no Wi-Fi in here. Um, let's see. So, in order to order a snack, we need to figure out what you guys want to order. Uh, you got your standard options. You got like sun chips you got doritos you got uh lays you got oreo cookies and those little like things you got honey buns sure uh funyuns cheese it's it's all snacky stuff no drinks um i'm gonna open up redemptions and let you guys decide what you want to order Once it gets to... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and pause Redemptions. Uh, oh, no, we got a few more. I'll wait until 40 comes up. 40 might be the line. Okay. That that seems like it gives you guys enough time, would you say? To, like, type out what you want to do? Sure, 30 should be the line. Um... All right, copy and paste. Give us some more time before opening. Oh, okay, okay, so let you guys know what it's gonna be. Okay, so the next poll after this one is gonna be what plushie to buy uh, once you get off your shift. Maybe you should tell us beforehand, then let us type it out and then rapid hit enter, okay. You obviously can't order it right now because you apparently are in a lead box and you have no internet on the computer, but you could order it as soon as you get off your shift or maybe when you go on lunch break. We need more time to vote. Okay. So I'm used to uh, the series uh, being a little bit slower than this. You guys are super hyped for this. Come is not going to win. I will not allow come to win. I will skip any time that come is on there. I'm sorry. You're not allowed to come. This is the come veto. You can delete the uh, come option suggestions before creating the poll. Yeah, but I'd have to read over all 40 options first to make sure there's not come on there. And because I can choose multiple options, so you can just choose come and be wrong. F3 and then look for come. <sighs> um, I like my lazier option instead. Just waste your vote. You decide to get some uh, chips and uh, save them for dinner. Specifically, you decide to try and get some Doritos. You've heard that sometimes they've got fentanyl laced with them, which would be a fun way to spend the rest of your night. Um, you also want to try and grab a can labeled bees, but they are fortunately out. 
that's C4 on the list and it just completely out. You'll have to get that next time that is an option. Um, but in the very least, you can get some Doritos with the hope that maybe it's laced with fentanyl. It costs you a dollar. This is not too bad for Doritos and is fine. You could decide to go ahead and pocket them for later since you can have them for dinner. You decide to check the notice board on the way over that's hidden behind the counter here. It doesn't seem like there's anything important. Just, you know, uh, pretty much all the stuff that he said prior to you, along with like a, a like group raffle for like some sort of like uh, basket of fruit or something. It looks like that offer was there like maybe a couple years ago and just no one's actually like taking it down off the raffle board. So, yeah. It turns out that updating this message board thing is not as important as he landed out to be. Um, so, like I said, now we're going to decide what plushie to get. Okay? Do you guys need a minute to think about it real quick? Chat seems like overwhelmingly uh, voting. I, like, I don't even know if I need to put a poll. It looks like everyone's saying Oxgu. Um, would you say that's correct? Yes, no. I could just make a quickie poll, and not actually use anyone's points. Oxgu, I saw a worm on a stream. String. Worm on a string. Uh, what else we got? We got uh, Brie from the March of the Mice. Uh, the 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 thing. Um, a pee pee. All right. The PP. I didn't use the uh, the umlaut thing over uh, the A. I apologize, but the the IKEA shark is what we're referring to with Bahel, or however you pronounce that. Vote on what plush you are fantasizing about buying with all of your new money you're getting. If you got the extension thing up on the side, it refreshed that. I fucked up the config. It should work now. Um, what's wrong with it? Seems like it's working great. Bree's a little mouse with a uh, a sword and uh, a red um, scarf. In the very least, this is the one you'll buy first. What you buy after this... Who knows? This poll is a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. Takeout would be wonderful, sweetheart. Uh, I'm fine with whatever you want to order. Uh, wife, do you want to be the tiebreaker here? Special wife uh, powers. Okay, uh, which one do you vote for? The options are Brie, Oxgu, uh, or Pee Pee. Can we get a picture of Oxgu in the game if we buy him? Sure. Choose wifely. Those are cursed. I think Oxgu. Oxgu it is. Oxgu is actually winning the, the regular vote as well with 54 over 51 is the next option. So Oxgu wins. 
You decide that you're going to buy Oxku, and then probably Bree, and then Peepee, and you'll see where it goes from there. But definitely Oxku first. Definitely have a little bit of an emotional support animal. This is a new thing you like, yes? Buying plushies? Personality unlocked. You're making some good money, so, you know, it's not going to be too bad to, to, to get something. Um, a man walks in pushing a stroller. Uh, he walks up to the counter. Hey, um, I, I've got a, a reservation for uh, Eric, and uh, I just want uh, to get my room situated. Let me go ahead and... Uh... Burger sounds great, honey. Uh, let me go ahead and open up uh, the thing. Open up Redemptions. Was that enough time to like think up an answer or like do you guys need more time? Maybe five more seconds? Okay. I apologize. Um, let's see. New poll. More time uh, for people with higher latency. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not used to it going this fast. Uh, used to be like with like March of the Mice and stuff, where I'd be like, all right, once we get like 10 to 15, uh, I'll go and cut it off. And that would be like a couple minutes of waiting. But tonight it's just like 40 instantly. Um, yeah, Twink Master, check out the thing that Orthogonal Caster just linked. Uh, that will give you the rundown of everything you need to do. I got popular. Well, it also helps that Fred rated us, and I really appreciate that. So thank you so much, Fred. I don't know if he's still here, but that was very kind of him. He's a good dude. March of the Mice was probably a bit too serious and it being war-based, right, when uh, an actual war broke out. Uh, not good timing. So I, I think a little bit more lighthearted would be good. Still good, but uh, definitely rough emotionally. So something a little bit more lighthearted would be good. Um, Tana Nower is like, what if you were a guy filled with bees who could talk? Let's see. Looks like almost all of these are check him in in some variety, shape, or form. Uh, sure thing, Eric. What's your last name? Uh, it's, it's Smith. Um, it's just me and the, the, the baby. Um, you check the computer for a reservation. There is an Eric Smith on record. Um, more cheerful. I'm sorry. Yes. Greet him almost obnoxiously cheerfully. Excuse me. Let me try that again. Hi. Yeah, Eric. So what's your name? And, and, um, what's your last name? I just want to check the computer for your for your reservation. Uh Yeah, uh it's 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 Eric Smith. All right. You smile real big despite the fact that you don't feel that. You type real loud using your computer. Um and you continue to smile at him and then you check for him and he's in there. 
Uh, great. Uh, I'll need like, uh, do you guys have like a changing table or something like that? I just need, you know, obviously, you know, uh, just need a place to do that. Uh, I, I think she, she needs, a. uh, let me go ahead and close out of this. Um, all right, so give you guys a couple seconds to think about what you want to say. Uh, if you click the option to add a town of nowhere thing, it'll say you can't do it. But once I open it, you'll be able to, does that work? Okay. I feel like I've given you guys a couple seconds there. I'm going to go ahead and open up Redemptions again. All right. I'm releasing the floodgates. Here we go. Once it hits 40, I'll close it again. Uh, someone gave... Uh, okay, I'm going to have to look at all the sub stuff here in a minute. Uh, Bat plushies, thank you for the sub. That was a good amount of time to wait. Okay. I don't feel like people are rushing as much right now. Okay. I can uh, probably pause redemptions there because it looks like it stops. Um, all right. Create a new poll. While the uh, poll's going, could someone get me up to speed? Does anyone have a link to the video? Also, Pingal. I'm sorry. I'm going to skip all the Pingals probably tonight. Uh, there is a video that's one minute long that'll explain everything you need to know. That one that Moobot just linked. Thank you so much, Luigi guy. It's one minute long, and I'll tell you how to play, and also what's going on vaguely. There's a straw pull for you. Nah, Luigi guy's got my back. The plot right now, uh, this is your first day working at the uh, front desk. I guess I should change um, that. Give me a second. There we go. Okay, does this... Uh, is this enough information to understand what's going on, more or less? Just everything that's on screen? Also, f while you guys vote, um, I was thinking about, instead of having the character picture there, have uh, chat running by there. Um, uh, I don't know how to make it look nice. I like the picture. Helps some, right? Chat kind of looks bad on those. Let us sit on his face. <sighs> Yeah, you don't need to say that. It should be added post stream in order to avoid not say for work stuff. True. Uh, you decide to call Max Swell, your boss, whose name is not Max Swell, but you're calling him that, uh, and ask him if you have any changing tables. Uh, while you start to call him up, you go, uh, does the baby have a, a reservation? Uh, with us as well. Uh, your boss picks up before he gets a chance to answer that absolutely, like, insane request. Hey, uh, hey, boss, do we have a, uh, a place to, to change babies? We have one out here in the lobby. Uh, yeah, um, yeah, we do. Uh, there, there should be one in the, uh, the, the public bathroom and in some of the suites. Uh, Do you need anything else? Is everything going out okay out there? The baby is in the lobby, not the changing. Yeah, the baby is in the lobby. Yes, sorry. That was, 
You can decide to internalize Bloss. Your boss's name is now Bloss, and his name is Maxwell. Does your character have negative intelligence stat, or are we just like that? I, I mean, you guys are deciding what his personality is, so yes. Um, you hang up on your boss and get back to uh, Eric as he stands in, in front of you. Uh, yeah, um, yeah, no, we we have a, a rare, we both are are going to be staying in the same room. Um, she's a she's a baby, so she would need to stay in the same room with me um, as that I'm her, her dad. There's a moment of silence as you both stare at each other as if the other person is absolutely the most insane person that has ever spoken before. And yet... Uh... Do you guys want to uh, do anything in a result or do you want to just give him... Uh, a room. Okay. Just give him the room? Okay. Uh, you set him up with a room that, uh, the computer says is empty, and he heads off. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm sorry about that. I know the baby thing is, I know this is like a, a swim resort, but like... Um, you know, uh, just me and the, the wife have been having some, some issues. Um, and, uh, I just figured it would be, uh, you know, good for us to get away for a bit and, and kind of have a little bit of space. Um, I, she, uh, so, so we, do, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just need someone to talk to. Is it okay if I, 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 I talk to you for a second? I'm going to make a, a poll that's just yes or no. You can do either of these options with a smile on your face. Yes, we don't mind, or yes, we do mind. Yes, you would like to hear uh, from him. Smiling is a free action when you're doing customer service. You may not actually feel it. Basically, yes is you would like to hear his backstory. I probably should disable stream elements. <laughs> uh, by free, you mean forced under being threat of being fired. Yes, that is actually what I mean. Yes, yes, actually. Uh, so you guys say yes, you do want to hear more. Oh, thank you. Um, so... Um, my wife just gave birth and, um, you know, we're, we're, we're bottle feeding because we, we need to, um, you know, just the baby doesn't take to, to breast milk. And, um, uh, so when, when she was pregnant, we agreed that if it was a boy, we'd name it after her, her grandfather. And if it was a girl, we'd name it after my grandmother and, you know, she's a girl. So, you know, we named her after my grandmother and, um, She's like really upset because I thought we like were on the same level with that. Um, and um, she's like, she's not happy with me right now. And so, like, I'm just, I'm, I mean, like, we live like the next town over, but I just felt like we should spend a little bit of time, um, apart. A, a, a Uh, just, just, just until things cool down. Um, 
Do you guys need a uh, a vote for this? What's the baby's name? We can just do that without having to do. Uh, well, her her name is Grandma, and I, I can't figure out why my wife is upset because uh, she said that that was okay. So I signed the document, and now she's mad at me, and I, I don't know what's wrong. Um, anyway, thank you for the key. Uh, I, I'm going to go get set up in a room. Thank you so much. Uh, he goes ahead and leaves. Yep, just sort of sitting here again. Just kind of, kind of vibing, not doing anything. Suddenly, uh, something outside the window uh, just fills the entire area of the 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 front windows. Whatever this thing is, slithers up to the front counter. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and open her up for redemptions. Uh, I'll give you guys a second to uh, type out what you guys want to do. Okay. Is that enough time? Hopefully. Opening up redemptions. Jesus fuck! <laughs> <laughs> that was 41 right there. Uh Okay. All right. This is a new problem and I don't know how to deal with it. Um Here's the poll. Rev, you forgot we're monster fuckers. I, I did my best, man. I did my absolute best, okay? But you guys are horny for fucking anything. Like, what do you want me to do? Legit, what do you want me to do? Should I increase the cost on the, uh... The, uh, the redemption? To, like, slow down how many redemptions people are doing? Increasing the costs will probably not help much. I could, it's right now at 380, uh, which I believe is set for like one hour of watching me. Um, that number is super abstract, but if you watch me for an hour and you click the button and you get your points, then that, that way you get, you know, points fairly regularly. So that way, if this is your first time watching this, you can actually have, you know, the ability to interact within the first hour. Um, if I increase it too much, um, then it'll, it'll be a thing. A lot of regulars have a lot, a lot of points. Are we still doing this last Thursday of the month? Uh, so I need to make it not on a week where I need to do art. 
that was a mistake this week because I got to do a painting. And it's kind of panicky that I need to like do a painting and this. But um, so the next one will probably be uh, the end of this month. If I every other week is an arcade video next week is not the week after that is the week after that is not. I mean, I can just jack up the points real quick and then I can lower the point cost um, as appropriate. Um, so the uh, top four, I would say, are all addressing this thing. You say, uh, you decide to greet this gentle creature, Noe. Uh, excuse me. With the most earnest and sincerity you can muster, you say, Hello, can I help you today? Do you have a reservation? Meanwhile, while you're thinking over what to do, he was just like, Yeah, um, I've got a reservation. I need to just, um, check in. My name's Thomas. I just need to just get a room. Uh, checking in the computer does reveal that there is a Thomas scheduled for today. He seems nice. He seems very trustworthy. Last name? I was born before times when there were families, before there were needs for such, and as a result, I have not chosen one. My name is Thomas. Do you need ID in order to complete this transaction? Okay, um, is, is a passport okay? I don't drive. I can't fit into cars. Chat says yes. Uh, okay. He hands you a photo ID. There's, there's no identifying information as far as what his last name is. It's just left blank somehow. There's a picture of him, a writhing mass of tentacles and just darkness. And, um... Yep, his name is Thomas. There is one reservation for a guy named Thomas. Just Thomas, no last no name. Get this man the best room. He is the Thomas. Checks out, get him a room. Get the man the room. The presidential suite, perhaps. Give him our room. Give him... Okay. He needs an accessible room? He's a, he's a writhing mass of tentacles and flesh. Um, should I make another poll for you guys? Okay. I'm going to give you guys a second to think about what you want to do. I think I'm also going to jack up the price on the uh, redemptions. I think future streams, we might lower it down again. But how about I double it? What should I change it to? 500 maybe? Four twenty for meme reasons? I don't know if this is going to change anything. It'll change by the end of the stream. Uh, and I need to basically like find ways to get points out of you guys. <laughs> On streams that aren't this. All right. 500 it is. Um, we're going to jack it up to 500. All right. You'll never get me points. All right. Opening up redemptions. Once it hits 40, I'll stop. 
You can always use predictions in order to crash the point economy. That's true. That's true. I'm going to pause redemptions here. How long have we been going for? Hour 15. I'm always surprised at how long uh, these scenes end up lasting. Um, where's the button? There it is. Multiple choice. All right, paste. Vote. I'm going to replay this animation because I think it's funny. There's no reason and it's not actually happening. I just want you to see it again while you guys vote. Literally a fuck the monster option. You know that's not going to win, right? Like, you can't just have sex with people. You have to, like, you know, get to know them. Uh, ask them what their, you know, wants and needs are in this world. Maybe, um, you know, see, see what they want from life. Maybe, you know, court them a bit. You know, you can't just go around fucking people. You really have to, like, try and, like, seduce them. Wine and dime them. This is the first time you're meeting this guy. This impossible horror from beyond time. You can't just fuck them. There are multiple options for fucking the monster. Let me see. <laughs> is your wife or girlfriend joining you today? <laughs> <laughs> trying to figure out how to be single uh, I, I didn't see what all these options were you decide to give him the room that he booked he must have had a good reason for it it's on the first floor uh, past the bell room uh, you ask him if he needs any uh, special accommodations he says no for I am the reason that people do need special accommodations. I am beyond the stars, and I am going to sit out in the sun and enjoy my time in the sun. Thank you. And then he leaves, going to the room that you gave him. Turns out sitting here is still boring. A woman stomps up the uh, front of the the the, the, the alleyway. Um, just upset as all can be. She walks up to the front counter and she slams her hand down on the counter and looks at you. My chicken Caesar salad was cold. Why would you do that? And some of the leaves, they were wilted. I, I demand a refund and I will not leave this place until I get one. Uh, I'm going to give you guys a second to, uh, type in what you want to do. Uh, 
Okay. That should be enough time to uh, think up an answer for what you want to do here. Twenty, thirty, forty, uh, forty-six, fifty. Okay. <laughs> uh, just, just decided to count that one off for you guys, so you knew what I was looking at. Um, all right, cool. Uh, here's the poll. Please do not threaten to toss this woman's salad. That's a bizarre thing to say, and I don't like it. <laughs> Tell her skill issue. <laughs> Get good. <laughs> Pull out a crucifix. Uh, let's see. Uh, give her the rest of the Doritos. You haven't touched your Doritos yet. Uh, she is a thing. Do not respond or acknowledge her. Put in earplugs. Aren't salads always cold? Honk. Uh, just reading over some of the ones that are like not winning. Uh, just for the sake of people on After Hours who are watching the full thing. Um... Uh, just got here from work. Uh, anyone have a recap? Uh, so the recap is those are objectives. You're working your first day as a front desk employee. And this woman is asking uh, for a refund on her cold Caesar salad. Um, you decide to tell her, I'm sorry to inform you, ma'am, but that... Chicken Caesar salad is traditionally served cold, but I apologize for the leaves. How about I give you a half refund? Absolutely not. Who do you think I am? I am. I know who I am. And I, I deserve better than this. I, I cannot believe the prices. That salad was $5. $5. Do you know what you could buy with $5? I swear to God, kids your age do not know anything about customer service. This is absolutely ridiculous. I need to see a manager. Give you guys a second to think about what you want to do to that. Boom, 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 That's probably copyrighted. Do, 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 do. Yeah, you can't add options yet. I'm, I'm waiting to give you guys a second to type out your answer, and then I'll actually hit enter. Okay? Just gotta make sure that you guys actually have a chance to react, rather than just... Alright, I'm opening up Redemptions. Rev is venting about <laughs> having to work customer service every session. Listen, you write what you know, man. You write what you know. All right, pausing redemptions at 54. Um, create multiple choice option. 
Let's see how long you guys need to vote. I'm gonna wait until things uh, slow down on the poll to determine when, you know, when, when to stop. Once the the votes stop going fast, then I'll um, then I'll give the result. Did I post the right uh, link? I think I did. There it is. How slow? Uh, slow enough that people can respond. Okay, good, good, good. There we go. Okay, it was just not refreshing results. The amount of choices increased. Yeah, I increased it to 54 because... I just choose all the ones that you like. <laughs> just looking over some of these responses uh call mac the knife swell skill issue skill issue name random features in hope of summoning the intruder to get her out uh yell intruder sus then throw doritos doritos at her uh free action cry you're looking at them sacrifice to thomas uh, tell her you would not be high, paid this uh, uh, behavior and you will call security if she continues. Eat the salad in front of her without breaking eye contact, suplex. There's a lot of like, try and get Thomas back in here and then just like random violence throughout the window. Tell her to eat it with her ass, kill her, throw a computer at her, uh, run away, throw out on the street, make her worse. Um... Like, there's a lot of very like, violent options here. So I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna combine the uh, combine the top three here. You decide that you're going to say extremely friendly. This is important. Because this is your job, and you just got this job, and despite the fact that you don't like working, you do like buying plushies, and that's important to you. So putting up with customers like this are what's going to be able to separate you from being able to get the plushies that you want. So if you can deal with this, you can get those plushies, and that is worth the trouble. You decide to stay extremely friendly and aggressively friendly, no matter what other option is chosen. You look at her and you say, I'm sorry, ma'am, that sounds like a skill issue. Would you like me to microwave your salad for you? <laughs> she just sort of screams and uh, disappears from existence. Uh, and without leaving the room, she's just gone. You keep hearing a honking sound. Uh, turning to your right, you see a clown down the hallway where there's all the rooms. Oh, hey, who is that with the raid? Uh, the Grapefruit. Thank you for the raid, my dude. Uh, I'm going to uh, open up Redemptions again. If you guys have not uh, seen this before, uh, I think it's uh, exclamation point town uh, T-T-O-N. Uh, check that link that Mubot just posted. That'll get you the one minute summary of what you need to be dealing with in order to uh, catch up on what's going here. Welcome, everyone. Um... Long story short, it's a D and D with chat where I'm playing the DM. You guys are all collectively role playing this one character. Uh, you could add the options using the 
add TTON option, and then um, you choose what you want to do. This is your first day working as a front desk uh, employee at the second oldest, formerly the oldest um, seaside resort located 500 miles from the, the Gulf Coast of uh, Mexico. And um, you just dealt with a Karen, and now there's a clown. Good luck. All right, so that probably gave you guys who were here enough time to think about what you want to do. I'm going to um, clean up all these things real quick um, and open up redemptions when you guys are ready. Opening up redemptions. Jesus Christ. 20, 30, uh, 36, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48. 49.50. Okay, I'm going to stop it at 52. There's the uh, pull. So, uh, in order to uh, interact... For those of you guys that just joined us via that raid, again, thank you, uh, Gray. Uh, click on what you want to do uh, in that poll and just click all the options that you think uh, that you want to do. You want this character, Max, uh, what's his name? <laughs> Mike Oxmall. Um, thanks for that, chat. This is why I let you guys pick your name. Um, <laughs> Do you honk with that ass? Flirtatious. Gun, Texas style. Honk aggressively. Attempt clown to clown communication. Uh, is there a reservation for Mr. Sexy Clown? Yo, Joker, run. Call shit security and tell them the clown just killed the CMO. Uh, I don't know what CMO stands for. Um, take a intimidatingly deep breath. This clown needs to know how strong your lungs are. Chief Medical Officer. Okay, it's an SS-13 joke. Got it. So in occasions like this, where uh, the top results are um, like completely the opposite of each other, I'm going to go with whichever one gets more votes. Um, so currently, the winning answer is do not look at the clown. Do not acknowledge the clown. It lurks. It honks. It knows. Uh, third place. Uh, is do not look, do not acknowledge, turn back very slowly and stare at the vending machine lovingly. You can do those two things without compromising. Uh, second place is honk back, so we can't do that one at the same time. But you do not acknowledge the clown's existence at all. You decide to turn back and just enjoy the fact that you can look at your vending machine. Oh shit, she's back. I don't plan on leaving this desk until I see a manager. This is ridiculous. I can't believe you do business like this. I mean, um, <laughs> the clown was better. <laughs> she appears less, um, physical than, uh, the uh, last time you saw her like she's just sort of like an apparition partially like invisible just hanging out floating in the air uh i'm gonna give you guys a chance to think about what you want to do about this situation and then i'll uh open up redemptions for you Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And 
gonna open up Redemptions. 20, 30, 40, 43, 45, 47, 48, 49. Looks like it stopped. Okay, 51. Got it. Um, create multiple choice. I think waiting and giving you guys a second to like come up with something and then letting it go to like 50 is appropriate for today. Um, I can't read all the... Okay. Uh, I, I will not call it until... How long do you guys think you need in order to... Uh, to, to vote on the poll. Not, not to submit an answer, but to vote. Because there's a lot of options here. I mean, I guess there's 50 options. So this is the problem. If I give you a lot of time to think about what you want to say, then a lot of people will submit. But if you have a, a lot of people submit then there'll be a lot of options that you have to decide between. Like two minutes? I'll late wait for the uh, the thing to like calm down. I think that's the best way to do it. Reading all the options will take two minutes on average for... Okay. Give a little extra time? All right. How about we give it like a solid like minute 30? Let's see how that works. And then I'll ask if you guys are done. Uh, set a timer for a minute 30. One minute and 30 seconds. This is a new problem. I did not expect people to be this hyped for this shit. Um, I expected this to be a stream to like maybe 50 to 100 people. And this is one of the most popular things I've done in a while. So I'll accept that. Um, the town of nowhere is awesome, dude. Are you guys enjoying, um, this, this iteration of it? Well, there's no spoilers, at least in this episode for season one. So if you guys want to go watch season one as well, um, it, you know, obviously it's over, it's concluded. Uh, it takes place all with one main character rather than the way that I'm doing this. Um, doing it this way, I think will make it easier for people who are just getting here. Um, Kinda. I hate our main character so far, but yes. That's your fault. I didn't decide this. Here's the poll again. How many hours will the first session be? Um, we'll be going for a bit longer. I've got a couple more scenes left to do. Uh, I expected this to be 30 minutes, for example. And for some reason, uh, we're almost to two hours. So, you know, I have no idea. Literally all the choices say the same thing. Yeah, that happens. <laughs> all right, that's a minute 30. And it looks like uh, it's calmed down. So it looks like... Um, there you go. Thank you, Luigi guy. Yeah, if you want to go watch the condensed version of season one, that's the link for it. Um... It, it was good. And I think people in chat can confirm that you don't need to have watched that in order to watch this. Um, uh, you say, my manager is just down the hall, ma'am. You motion to the clown. Um, as you politely direct her to the clown. That's literally the first four options. Five options. Six options. Seven options. Eight options. First eight options that one votes are all in, just reference the clown down the hallway. You know, just like, that's my manager over there. He approaches.
She looks at him and then looks at you. Are you being serious right now? This is your manager? No wonder your this this resort is so just <sighs> The clown looks at you and says, I'm afraid from the calendar. Its days are numbered. If April showers bring May flowers, then what do May flowers bring? Pilgrims! Uh, would you guys, uh, okay. I'm going to give you guys a chance to, uh, respond to this, uh, on what you want to do. Uh, so type in what you want to do. I know freedom of expression is a God given right, but you're overstepping here. Um, I do what I want. I'm going to give you guys a second to, uh, decide what you want to do and then I'll open up redemptions. Say like 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Opened up redemptions. We'll let it get up to like 50 options. Or once it slows down. Okay. That should be good. All right. Clear this out. Create a new option. Pull. There's new pull. And then let me set a timer again for a thing. Set a timer for a minute, 30 seconds. One minute and 30 seconds. Starting now. Um, in the meantime, what do you call a factory that makes okay products? A satisfactory... Where where do fruits go on vacation? Paris. Like pear, pear Paris. What did zero say to the eight? That bell looks good on you. Plus two parentheses lie. <laughs> uh. 
Um, all right. So the top voted option is act as if the clown doesn't exist and seem confused at the Karen's words. Tell her you'll go get him and walk down the now clownless hallway. Uh, that, that seems like it, obviously not the same thing as, uh, would you say that works with any of these other ones? We like to have fun here. How can the path be clownless if we're in it? <laughs> Um, we like to have fun here. Let me go get the manager. The clown begins to follow you as you go down to Maxwell's office. What do a tick and the Eiffel Tower have in common? They're both parasites. Y you know, like Paris, the... the They're, they're multiplying? Oh, did I accidentally make the second clown appear? Sorry. There's only one clown. Just had them set at different distances. Um, you walk into Maxwell's office. He's there. The clown is behind you. I thought it was meant to look like that. I'm sorry. There was not uh, supposed to be two clowns. Um, going to give you guys an, uh, a minute to write down what you want to say to your boss. Um, and then, uh, I'll need to clean up the responses real quick. How do you follow Will Smith in the snow? <laughs> you follow the Fresh Prince. The, the clown is telling all these pun jokes. Trying his best to just, like, get you to laugh, but you're not. Um... Alright, you guys ready for me to open up Redemptions? Alright, here we go. Boop. <laughs> I'm just seeing these scroll by in chat and they're just like utterly unhinged alright uh, we can probably let a couple more through go and hit enter if it doesn't let you okay that, that does look like that was it oh no no you guys need a little bit more time Okay, now I think we're good. Uh, the Fresh Prince of Bel Air was the first show that um, Will Smith was on. So, Fresh Prince, Fresh Prince, it's, um, it's a pun. It makes sense if you're an American and you've seen the show, I think. Um, is it still going? God, no. It was like a 80s, 90s, um, like family values sort of thing. Why couldn't the bicycle stand up by itself? It was too tired. Uh, 
vote. I'll set up a poll or a timer. Set a timer for a minute 30. One minute and 30 seconds. And we're starting now. There's a lot of options there. Vote. Vote, not goat, but vote. Vote. I don't trust stairs. They're always up to something. Vault. Did you hear the rumor about butter? He says, getting close to you. Well, I'm not going to spread it. Uh, you decide to inform him about the spectral Karen and pretend the clown doesn't exist. Yeah, that's that's Michelle. Um, don't she's she's just haunting us. Um, just like ignore, just she, like tell her we'll like just just fuck her. Honestly, I hate her. She's so annoying. Um. We had a priest come in and, and look at her, and it turns out that uh, she's just just going to be here until she gets her way, and uh, she's just insane. Um, I don't know. Um, give her a coupon or something. She'll probably shut up after that. If she doesn't, just call me, and I'll, I'll come and deal with her. Um, all right. I'm going to give you guys a chance to, uh, go ahead and think up what you want to do next. And, uh, let me know. Um, well, I guess you guys can, if you already have something typed in. All right, ready? Opening up redemptions. Okay, the requests are starting to slow down. I think we could probably maybe reduce the cost again. Uh, I will do that on the future ones, but that looks like enough requests from now. Okay. Um, create pull, open pull, copy and paste. And then uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, pull up 
um the thing and i'm gonna uh reduce the cost of the uh thing and that should help out a bit edit 380 is the cost that it was before let's see if that worked self-love is important too okay cool uh here's the poll again just in case you missed it um set a timer for one hour and 30 seconds one hour and 30 seconds Start wait no <laughs> hold up that's a little long uh cancel set a timer for one minute and 30 seconds one minute and 30 seconds that's better now. yeah figure it out you guys got an hour on what you want to do we're just gonna sit here in silence for an hour now <laughs> good streaming tech <laughs> Some people, some streamers do that when they do react videos. Do you have dates when I'm going to do the next town of nowhere? Uh, I think there's a charity thing coming up uh, soon. I will announce the next one. Tentatively, I'm going to say the 24th. Um... And go from there. I think Mike's doing a charity. I'm planning on being involved with that. Joltik, thank you for the sub. Thank you for the five months of support. Um, I don't know when it is. I'd like to be involved with it. I, I signed up on the, the list of times, but I didn't quite understand when it's taking place. Uh, so it's either very soon or like a while from now. That's Thanksgiving. It's Movember, yeah. All right. Uh, I, I will do my best to tweet out and post on stuff as well. He said at the end of uh, November. Okay. We'll, uh, we'll figure something out. I'm sorry for being wishy-washy on this. It's a lot easier for me to make scenes in the town of nowhere than it is, uh, March of the Mice, because I don't have to hand draw everything. I just have to, like, hand draw occasionally, like, uh, Thomas. Uh, but, yeah, go ahead and vote if you haven't. But it looks like the, uh, the choices are fairly locked in. Uh, let's see. You, you ask him, is it okay if I throw salt at her? Like, it's probably not going to do anything. I just want her, I just want to do that for my own sake since she's not a customer. And then you consider telling, uh, the, the Karen that you know how to use, uh, proper grammar and how to use pronouns. You also begin to actually worry because Maxwell, Mac Swell has not acknowledged the clown yet. Uh, I mean, don't assault her or anything. Assault, that's pretty good. Uh, but, uh, you know, uh, may maybe, you know, just, 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 I don't know. Here's, here's like a dollar. Go buy her something from the vending machine. She'll, she'll go away. I don't know. If she doesn't, just whatever. I'm going to close that, and then do you guys want to vote again? Or have another redemption, or do you want to go back to the front uh, desk? Go back. We'll just get her the bees. Buy her some garbage. Go back to the front desk. Okay. All right. So you'll go back to the front desk. The clown continues to follow you. Mm -hmm. 
Why, why can't a nose be 12 inches long? Because then it would be a foot. He says as he, like, you just, he follows you down the hallway. The clown continues to be there while the Karen is here. So where is your manager? Because I've been waiting here for an hour and I, I expect better service than this. Um, I'm going to open up redemptions. Go ahead and uh, uh, type what you want to do real quick, and then I'll open up redemptions. Okay, that should be enough time to have uh, typed thing out. So, opening up redemptions. Uh, this game is called The Town of Nowhere, uh, The Last Resort, Season uh, 2. Season 1 was streamed about two years ago. Um, and uh, it's a chat-integrated D&D, uh, &D, basically. Uh, there should be a thing if you do exclamation point T-T-O-N. Uh, go ahead and pause Redemptions because it looks like it's uh, slowed down. Uh, so they just use their channel points to go ahead and put things on a poll. And then I'm going to put those options that they said into a poll. And then it'll be a multiple choice poll. Um, we just go ahead and copy and paste that into chat. And then you can go ahead and, uh, nice. Yeah. Apparently the last town of nowhere was like, uh, 2020, I want to say. Here's the poll again, since the nices were going off in chat. Um, yeah, I remember explicitly that I had to... Um, someone asked if COVID was happening in this universe, and I said no, because I hadn't... Uh, <laughs> I hadn't prepared to write that into the universe, so uh, I opted not to. Started December 2019. Yeah. Yeah. Two, almost three years. Did COVID happen now? Uh, no, because then everyone's not wearing masks and it's weird. We're just going to ignore it. Man. Um, I'm going to continue to ignore the existence of COVID in my fantasy worlds. Um, we're allowed to have fun without having to worry about actual restrictions. There could be monsters here. We don't have to worry about the monsters of the real world. Um, also, I forgot to set a timer. Vote! The idea of quote unquote horror uh, is, you know, a level of escapism as a result. There could be a lot of problems in this universe. There's a clown and a Karen here. That's enough issues, man. What is this about a clown? Uh, looks like results are still coming in.
The real clown was the friends that we made along the way. Let's look at some of these ones that are not working. Tell the clown she thinks your jokes suck. Hello, it's me, the manager. I'm the manager. Tell the clown, uh, tell the Karen the clown is the manager. Suck the Karen. Yell, do a flip. We don't hear the spectral Karen anymore. Only Hotel California. What a lovely place. Buy our Doritos. The clown is manager. Stab her. Piss yourself. I'm the manager. Buy her some bees. Sadly, he passed away after hearing about your existence. Um, did you tell her, did you hear about the guy who kept dropping beef in the kitchen? He made so many mistakes. All right, your band? Who said that? Who the fuck submitted this one? I already deleted the thing, so I can't check. Who the fuck did that? Your band. Um, look, uh, it looks like, um, you say, listen, I'm sorry you're a ghost, ma'am, but here's a dollar. It just seems like a skill issue. Here's a coupon for a Slim Jim. Um, be gone. You check to see if Karen has a re the Karen has a reservation. You look up Michelle and you find one that has been ongoing for years. Um, unfortunately, it does seem that she actually is a paying customer, and you cannot get rid of her by calling a ghost lawyer to exercise her. A man wearing a fedora and a trench coat walks into the room. He looks very suave and smooth in it. He also looks very hairy as that he is like very hairy and large. Uh, is she giving you trouble? All right, I'm going to go ahead and open up Redemptions in a second. Go ahead and um, let you guys decide what you want to do here. All right. I take it is that you guys are typing in answers when chat goes suddenly just dead. All right. I'm going to open up Redemptions. There. <laughs> My blood pressure is through the roof, man. Please, I help. <laughs> Please help me. I beg you. It's hard to ignore, but um, maybe not totally visible on this sprite, but um, this man has a butterfly uh, painted onto his face, uh, which is a fairly difficult task as that his face is almost entirely covered in fur. I'm going to pause redemptions and then uh, create new poll. What time did the man go to the dentist? Oh, when he needed to. I, I, haven't, I haven't worked out that joke totally yet. I don't, I don't know where it goes. Um... Oh, 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 I got one. Uh, what do you call a snow... What do you call it when a snowman throws a temper tantrum? A meltdown.
Here's a uh, thing. Vote. <sighs> Clowns do not exist. Do not acknowledge the non existing clown. You're just making it worse. Uh, what are the options here? Spritz this stray animal with a square bottle. No animals allowed. Are you a sussy little sausage? Who the fuck are you? Backflip. What size are your feet? Fake a seizure. Pog. Hello, Saul. Ghostman? Daddy? Uh, sorry. Daddy? Dari. Daddy? Sorry. Uh, go on break. Daddy? Sorry. D uh, daddy? I mean, Daddy? Uh, sorry, Daddy? Are you single? You could change that, though. And yes, she is. Um, go on break. Say yes. All right. It looks like uh, the the top one says, uh, my blood pressure is through the roof, man. Please help me. I beg you. No worries. She's she's just a regular. Get, Michelle, get, get out of here. Okay. I'm going to have to. I'll, I'll call the cops on you if you don't leave. Okay? And you two! Get the fuck out of here! Michelle disappears in a huff, as does the clown. Uh, so you must be new here. Um... The, the clown just walked away. The, the, the Karen disappeared. Yeah. The, the clown has walked off down the hallway and is now just like honking randomly. Hey, um, I'm Randy. It's nice to meet you. You must be the new kid they hired. Uh, how's your, how are you enjoying your front first day? You, Uh, I'm going to give you guys a second to uh, come up with an answer. All right. I'm going to open up redemptions now. All right, I'm going to pause Redemptions because it looks like it's slowed down. All right, create multiple choice. People love to talk about their favorite shape. <laughs>
My favorite shape is an I. I don't even know what shape that is, man. I don't know. I fucking like circles, I guess. Like circles are okay. It's a good good shape. Solid. Water is round. Oh, I like your shape too, sweetheart. Wife. Don't you know you're not supposed to flirt with people when they're at work? You can flirt with me, it's fine. Vote. No, Randy did not say that. I'm sorry. I need to get better at voice acting. Are you going to call your micromanager? I think that's Abby or Herman, isn't it? Yeah. Herman had a whole bunch of boy time today. He he just needed the boy time. He's sleeping in Abby's nest right now. He's a good boy. I think the poll has calmed down. Nope, it's still getting votes. Okay, we'll give it a little bit longer. Vote. Sorry. It does look like the number of options is going down, which is good. People are running out of points. So, good. It doesn't look like anything's gaining traction. So it looks like the top option is Randy. Oh, that's right. Maxwell told me about you. Um, yeah. Um, so uh, do you work here too? Uh, thank you for saving my sanity. It's no problem, kid. We got we to gotta take care of each other here. And um, yeah, yeah. Uh, don't don't mind her. Michelle is always here. She'll 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 bug you from time to time. If she gives you any real trouble, just call me. Um, I work security here, so um, yeah. If there's if there's any issues with her or anyone else, you just let me know. Should be on speed dial on the phone. There, you just call me up. All right. You hear footsteps uh, coming down the hall. Oh, I see you've met uh, you met Randy. That's wonderful. Hey, Randy, how you doing? You, you, I, I take it that you handled the Michelle situation. Yep, and the other one. <laughs> Maxwell like quickly puts his fingers to his lips. It's thank you. Um, and I, I'm sure that Mike here thanks you as well. Um, well, I, I just came up here to let you know that, um, that that's all we need you for today. Uh, Mike, you did a great job. Uh, no complaints aside from, uh, Michelle, but that's fine. That's normal. Honestly, if, if you had not gotten a complaint from her, I would have been surprised and probably fired you on the spot. Um, okay. So, uh, thank, thank you. Um, we'll, we'll see you back to work tomorrow. Does that sound okay? Uh, I'm going to open up one more redemption for the night. So think up what you want to say. <laughs> I 
orthogonal caster, you're evil. Because <laughs> they can't do it. Because they, they're actually, like, typing out what they want to say. All right. I'm going to give it a second. For people to, to do it. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, I'm going to open up Redemptions now. Here you go. Just reject this one that says Shout Come. And... Pause Redemptions. All right, I saw... Whisper come. I'm rejecting that as well. Create new. Um, get rid of whisper come. Uh, and shout come. There we go. Create multiple choice. Click. Copy. And paste. There you are. Vote. Volt. Can't you block the word come? <sighs> um, you know, I don't know. I don't think that that I, I don't think I can do that. I think I'd have to ban come generally in chat. Also, come sneaking through every now and then is kind of funny. Um, and I don't want to ban people from saying come in my chat because I would have to ban Mike and that wouldn't be good. Um, all right, let me go ahead and pull up those, uh, those votes. Go ahead and copy paste it again. Coward? Nah. Everyone who would ban people for saying come is a, a, a coward. Vote. Votes are still coming in, so I'm going to give it a minute. <laughs> Let's look at some of these ones that aren't doing great. Uh, no, I'm quitting. Fuck you. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Kill the clown. Blame the other guy. Do an interpretive dance in the style of Henry Gifford's 1852 airship. I don't know what that's a reference to. Get his business card. Ask Randy if the other situation is the big issue uh, the resort faces. Sounds good, boss. Now, can I get a sucky wucky or no? <laughs> Please, no. <laughs> uh, so smile so hard. It hurts. Can I sleep in the bell room? Yes, do a little jiggle. Today was awesome. Dab and go home and eat your chip dinner. Um, all right, what is... All right, are we still going on the votes? Looks like it's calmed down. Uh, if you have any art you want to submit, now would be probably the time to do so. Um, looks like, think longingly about Oxgu plush that you're going to buy and the time you're going to spend with your hot boy, monster boyfriend. And you say, you think about those things, but out loud you say, yeah, I'll be back. By the way, when do I get paid? Uh, every other week on Thursdays, if that's okay. Um, um, and then you say, I would absolutely love to come back. Thank you so much for this opportunity. You smile and say, feeling no such feeling. All right, so yeah, uh, go ahead and just clock out, and uh, I'll, I'll see you tomorrow. You clock out, and you say, as you're clocking out, you say, I've been Mike Oxmall. 
signing off. And um, that is what I have planned for you today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, let me know, especially on After Hours. It uh, looks like chat here enjoyed it. Um, do you feel like the new user experience is better with the, uh, the group and uh, personal objectives? Uh, do you like the idea that it's a different person every time? I don't know. Let me know. Uh, I like this anthology type of story. Yeah, that might make it a little easier. Because next time, you won't be playing as Mike. You'll be playing as someone else. But Mike will be somewhere in the resort uh, doing what he's doing. Um, the characters who checked in are going to be in future episodes as well. But I don't think it's super relevant that you need to watch those uh, this episode in order to know what happened here, right? Doing my best. What about his Oxgoo plush? Well, you have to find him and talk to him. Uh, we got some art here. Uh, you'll have to give me a second to set up a, uh, display region for it. Uh, let's go ahead and close out of that. And pull up some art. Uh, we got three arts. Uh, the first one is from Skarmory777. Um... Welcome to the town Here it is. season two. Says, you don't Hello and welcome to Vine Stops. Today we'll start our typical introductory tape. Red box stops. We'll be making guest Yules appearances. In the garage. So maybe when you have a chance, go watch it. This season Solid is going to reference be taking to place Joe's in the garage. Multiple different main characters. Uh, Each episode is a different main character. Oh, the video is playing. Oh, don't have Jesus. Okay, sorry about that. Why is it playing? It's not even here. Oh, it is here. I'm so sorry. Okay, let me try that again. Sorry. Um, there we go. Okay, cool. And it's not playing the thing again? Uh, it says, hello and welcome to Vine Sauce. Today we'll start a typical uh, introductory tape. Red box stops. And then my eyes go red and so does Vinny's. And it says, Yol is in the garage. Wonderful. Thank you. Uh, we've got this next one from Zachariah Ribbit. Uh, I believe this is no. Uh, just clawing their way from something. Really like the perspective here and the color palette. Looks great. Holy shit. Um, amazing work. Thank you so much. And then we got this one from uh, Zachariah Ribbit as well uh, with Mike. Uh, falling head over heels uh, for uh, Thomas. Absolutely, like, yes. Every, okay, so here's here's an issue, right? If chat's playing multiple different characters, every single character is going to be like a monster fucker, yeah? Like, you guys are going to, like, be fighting with yourself to get... In relationships, like the next character you play as will also be trying to get with Thomas, right? Battle Royale of horny monster fuckers. Uh, someone that said they were, uh, trust no one, not even yourself. I can't upload my art. Um, I don't know why it's not working. Try Twitter. Maybe there it is. Thank you, Luigi guy. I need to change the file size. Well, why don't I go ahead and thank the uh, the people who subbed uh, during the stream? So I'm gonna just bring up. Uh, let's see, gifted subs, raids, and subs. Okay. And uh, will we ever play as Mike again? If I can think up some more stuff for Mike to do. Okay, small issue. I can't actually check the activity feed for uh, subs and stuff. Um, well, shit. OK, 
Okay. How about not reward redemptions? And not followers. Okay. Joystick, thank you for the five months of support. And I know there are other ones, but the activity feed seems to be broken. I do not know how to check this. Uh, do, do you know how to check that, Luigi guy? Art uploaded. It's also stalling for a little bit of time so that we could upload his art. Amazing. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, these are good. Hold up. Let's zoom in. Uh, this is from uh, Fafnir's Blood. Uh, you've got a... Uh, Hi, what's your last name? Mike Oxmall. Uh, is the intruder single? Skill issue. Uh... Hello, can I help you today? Thomas. I like the little arrow pointing to Thomas there. Colors are so good. And then the clown. <laughs> and Randy. Please zoom. Sure. Let me see what I can do here for you. Uh, is that better? Why is Thomas... He's not caked. Oh my god. I hope he's not. Uh... It's the intruder. I, I love skill issue being the, the repeated like, like, fuck this guy thing. Um, how would I know? Okay, fine. Fafnir, did you draw uh, Thomas caked up or not? Uh, you can look up on the Moobot dashboard. Oh, thank God. Thank you so much. Okay. Uh, Joltik, thank you for the five months of support. Um, no, but I will. Okay, so there you go. There you go. We both get our way. I get to have five minutes where that's not the case. Bat plushies, thank you for the sub. Uh, Anon, thank you for the gift sub to Minmo Cat Foods. Also, Anon, thank you for the gift sub to Queen of Waffles. Uh, Fred, thank you for the raid. Zachariah Ribbit, thank you for the uh, 33 months of uh, resubs. Uh, Kazakomo, thank you for the 11 months of support. Ready for the sequel of one of my favorite stories of all time. Holy shit, that's amazing. Thank you so much. Uh, that, that really tickles me. That, that feels good. Thank you. Uh, the builder, thank you for the 23 months of support. Good job, dog. Thank you for the five months of support. Um, let's see, three days ago, three days ago, three days ago, two days ago, a day ago, a day ago. Lanesso resubbed yesterday. Uh, Zombie Wang. Okay, no, I read that one. A day ago, a day ago, three hours ago. Uh, Dr. Spama, thank you for the five gift subs and the gift sub to Rising Pressure. I think that was yesterday. And then Lieutenant Shadow, thank you for the uh, 19 months of support. Um, and then Luigi Guy, thank you for the 78 months of support. Okay, I think I got everyone. Thank you, Luigi Guy, as well, for being an awesome mod, setting up the uh, the things. Uh, thank you for telling me about this Moobot feature so I can actually see that shit. I will 100% forget um, that information for next time. And also, thank you, everyone, for showing up and uh, making the time and effort that was put into this worth it. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much. Um, and, uh, yeah. Um, and then, also, thank you... Um, Thank you, Dustin Competent, for the uh, the thing that. Um... Okay, cool. Uh, he's got a better version that should allow people using VPNs next time to be able to do it. Um, thank you, and I will see you tomorrow with something uh, a little less uh, complex, probably Minecraft. Knowing me, but I'll see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. <sighs>